tunaona hali penye tumepelekwa kuna serikali ambayo badala ya kufanyia watu kazi kazi yao ni kutuso, wanatusomea sisi kila siku wanakaa katika vyombo za habari wanatusomea umesikia waziri akisema kama unalia mafuta yamepanda enda uchimbe kisima chako huyo ni mtu anataka kuwe serikali na sisi tunasema hivi any minister who is misbehaving we shall impeach him sawa sawa tutaambia president ruto if you not fire that guy we have the power to initiate the impeachment of that minister and we shall do it we are not joking sawa sawa mtume watu mmewapikia kura waenda wafanye kazi na hawa masiri hakuna mtu aliyowapikia kura hao ni wa fanye kazi wa president they were not employed by people of Kenya sawa sawa if they misbehave and the president does not fire them we shall fire them kitu ya tatu sisi tumesema wakati huu hatutakuwa na maandamano but tutakuwa na njia ingine ya kuambia serikali kama mmechoka na kazi ondoga kweli si ndio kwa sababu si mnajua si tunaweza. Si tunaweza. Kwa hivyo tuko tayari. Wao wafanyie wananchi kazi. Na kwa kishindikana si tuko hapa. Chambo lingine mimi ni mbunge wenu wa Westlands. Mmenipatia mihula tatu. Na nimesema hii muhula na wautumia kwa roho yangu yote na nikimaliza Munisindikize twende tutoe jamaa huko sijui. Sawa sawa. Kwa sababu hata ndugu yangu sakaja anajua kura zangu ndio zilipitisha yeye. Hey. Si ni kweli? Hey. Wakati mimi niliondolewa watu wangu walikasirika sana. Wakasema tutapikia sakaja. Na sakaja akapenda fit na hizo kura zangu. Na sasa hii nikisema na kuja niko mbaya. Sisi tunaenda kuchukua ile. Na tuko tayari. Tutatembea pamoja kanisa mtuombe. Mungu awezi kutupatia kitu ambayo hauwezi ukihastamili. Because ile hali tuko nayo ngumu sasa tutapata suluhisho. And the solution is within us. We are not going to look beyond Kenya. We are not going to look in heaven. We shall look within us. Tuombe ya kwamba hata wakati Kibaki aliingia Kenya ilikuwa hali ngumu na Kibaki akarekebisha mambo, si ndio? Kwa hivyo hii ni wakati ambayo itapitwa na upepo na itakuja Kenya itaruti mahali penye wananchi watakuwa. Nyinyi omba tukue na uhai tufike wakati huo and we are ready to provide solutions for this country. Sawa sawa. Tumeambia serikali kitu ya kwanza mlituahiti mtapunguza karama ya maisha. Sai from the time they took over from Uhuru Kenyatta. Imerudi chini ama imeenda juu? Si ndio? Hata ile tunachifunia ati mbolea 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 wale wakulima wamesema sasa karama ya kutoa mahindi hata kwa shamba itakuwa juu kushinda hiyo mbele yao. Si ndio? Mafuta iko juu. Kila kitu iko juu. Sasa hii wanasema tunue mafuta ya ma, magari ya stima. Hiyo stima sasa ndiyo hata kali kushinda mafuta yenyewe. Si ni kweli? Kwa hivyo we must find the way how we are going to tackle these things. Na wa Kenya wakati baba anasema mnasema huu mzee ametuchosha lakini kama mzee huyu Zaira Dinga asipotoa sauti ndio tunaweka break kwa vitu singine. si ndio kwa hivyo msikize sauti yake sana ni sauti ya Mungu inasungumuza juu ya huyo mzee na akitoa direction nyenye msikize kwa makini let us work together sisi hatutaki mtu yote mabaya but we know we need solutions for the problems we are experiencing now 
Sawa sawa. Kwa hivyo mimi nimekuja hapa kushirikiana na nyinyi 